right, boys, we are back. We're at the trade deadline. Well, almost at the trade deadline. We're about a few days away. And the last video, I was asking you guys, what should we do about our special teams? I got a lot of different responses. Um, I got a weird one saying that you guys wanted me to trade Yakupov away. Trade Yakupov for a solid sniper. And you know what? That's not a bad idea. But the thing is, how can I trade away Yakupov? I mean, 21 years old. I know he's a playmaker. We already have one in Duchesne. But this guy is just, he's turning out to be outstanding. Look at that. A for offense, B for defense, B for athleticism. Uh, I, and you know what? I mean, we're having a good season. We are. I mean, we're first in the league in goals four. So I don't want to shake up that first line. Improving the power play and then taking away from our five-on-five -five game play might not work. So what I want to do is the power play, yeah, that's important. But what's more important to me is the penalty kill. We already have the most goals for per game. Now, if we can make... If we can make it that we have the most goals against per game, that will help more than helping our power play, in my opinion, okay? So what I want to do here is, I want to go back to stats, the team stats for the season. I want to figure out which team has the best penalty kill and take a look at their lines and see why they're having the best penalty kill. And then try to maybe match it up, alright? So, penalty kill, we are, I mean, we're 10th in the, wait, no, 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 sorry. Yeah, that's from the bottom. We're 21st in the league, okay? So let's find the best team here. It's the Pittsburgh Penguins and the Los Angeles Kings, Vancouver Canucks. Okay, so let's check out these lines and see why they're the best team for the penalty kill. Let's see, try to match them. I wonder if they have uh, Malkin and Crosby up there, or if they just don't, uh, if they have, uh, what's it called, grinders. So hang on, Pittsburgh. All right, let's go to penalty kill. All right, so their penalty, look, I mean, they got Crosby and Malkin on their penalty kill, their first line penalty kill, two playmakers. So it's not the grinder power forward man maybe it just is overall so in that case i should put o'reilly and nash right uh they got bortozo and niskanen as their defensive co um, pair so uh, all right so we checked that let's check out la see what they got la stole and richards two-way two-way green and dowdy uh let's check out vancouver I don't know. It might just be it might just be luck, like the simulation process. See, I mean, Vancouver's got more believable Kessler and then Lapierre Grinder, right? Uh, and then look, let's take a look at ours. Columbus, Malhotra, and O'Reilly. I mean, so we should have Nash on the power play then. You know, like uh, it's just I don't I don't know. It just does not make sense to me. So you know what, we're going to try and move up, uh, I'm just going to try and switch things up because we obviously can't be doing worse than we are right now. Oduya for Bieksa, alright, uh, and Malhotra, um, yeah, you know what, I want to put O'Reilly back as the center, we'll give Malhotra the second line, and I want to take McClement off, I want to put like, we'll give, Le nah, Nash is better, I want to put Nash back there, I know boys, but like, Freaking Pittsburgh, they're leading the league in the penalty kill. They got Malkin and Crosby, two playmakers. So it's not the player type. It might just be the overall. So we'll give it to O'Reilly, Nash, Hamannick, Bieksa, Malhotra, Marshawn, Goodbranson, and Oduya, all right? We'll try it out. We'll try it out. Uh, yeah, we'll leave that the same. And I don't want to trade for a sniper. I don't want to give up Yakupov or Johansson, all right? I mean, we're scoring goals. Five on five is more important than special teams. It would be nice if our special teams was helping us out a bit more, but it's not. But still... Uh, now, what we were also saying in the last video is maybe uh, try switching uh, Nash down here for a point shot. So that's what we'll do. We'll move Nash down here. What handedness is Nash? I think he's left-handed. Yeah, he is left-handed. What about DeHaan? Uh, he's left-handed as well. So we'll have DeHaan setting up Nash for one-timers, all right? Uh, instead of Hamnick, we're going to bring up Langdeskog. All right, so we got, yes, that looks nice. And then instead of Hamannick down here, we're going to bring up Marshawn. All right, then BX and Markov down there. All right, so that's how we're going to fix the power play. We'll hopefully fix it. Same thing here. We'll put uh, Nash, Dahan on the points. Duchesne and... Duchesne and... Let's put uh, Landeskog instead of two playmakers in Yakupov and Duchesne. All right, so there you go. There's the changes right there. Now we're coming up to the trade deadline. I was thinking... Maybe trade for a fourth line grinder that could um, be added to our our penalty kill. Someone who's really good. So let me just go through the teams here and figure out if there's any good grinders that we could pick up. Anaheim, uh, no. Boston, no. Uh, Chris Kelly maybe. He's a center though. Uh, Buffalo, 
There was one guy on uh, Dallas, Steve Ott, that I was really looking, really looking at. I was thinking that he might be able to help our team just a little bit. Uh, yeah, let me just, you know what, let me just go to Dallas. Steve Ott, you see how he's an 83 grinder? So that's what I'm going to see. I'm going to see, uh, let me just go to trading block and see what Dallas wants. Trading block. I wouldn't mind picking up somebody to help out our pet. I, I don't want to trade away Yakupov, but I wouldn't mind trading for a fourth line grinder. All right, so they don't want to trade away, uh, what's his face, Steve Ott. But they don't want to hold on to wingers, and he is a winger. Um, so who do they want? They want wingers. They want wingers, but they want to give away their wingers. That's interesting. They want prime age and youth wingers. So we might be able to trade for Steve Ott. So let's go into the trade deadline here. That's the only thing I'm going to trade for, boys. I don't want to, uh, I don't want to affect our top two lines. I think they're doing good, all right? I mean, we're a good team. We're a good team. I don't want to change things, and then all of a sudden we become a bad team. All right, I don't want to do that. We have our team. We just got to find out which lines on this team can make our team produce at the best that it possibly can. Uh, okay, we'll continue one more game. Can we win going into the trading block? Okay, another five. Okay, I mean, look, we're good. We're a good team. I'm not going to trade away Yakupov, boys. I'm not going to do it. I want to see if we can get Steve Ott for our fourth line grinder. Instead of Bull or Dorset, uh, Joseph Camarosa, Cramarosa. Um, oh wow, Grinder A minus A minus. Hell yeah, I'm gonna have to do this. Um, they want 2050. Oh, I can't trade away those picks though, right? No, I can. Wait, 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 wait. which year are we in? Did I? Are we in year 2014, and that's next year? Oh, I want to make that trade. I want to make that. It's it's only one. F Oh, it's Detroit's fourth round. Okay, that's fine, because I still have... What? Oh, they want Cam... <laughs> what am I thinking? They want Cramarosa. No way. No, I I'm an idiot, boys. I thought it was this. My bad, my bad. No, they want Cramarosa. No, I'm keeping that grinder. No way, no how. My bad. I had a brain fart there. All right. So let me go to Dallas here. They want defense. Okay, so hang on. Let me put Steve Ott on the table. He's a good little player, boys. He's got two years left, so if the salary cap... I know we got to sign a bunch of players here at the end of the season. We can trade him at the end of the year, or we can do a little math and see what's going on. I know we have some players who will be restricted free agents, so I mean, we, I think we can get away with it. We should be fine. We're still going to have like six mil of uh, salary cap at the end of the season at least. Oh, wait, wait, way, way more than six mil. So if we're going to trade away this guy, I don't want to affect any of our first lines, but if we're getting rid of... I'd rather keep Moss or Bull. Hang on, let's check out Moss. David Moss, he's pretty good in the offensive category. He doesn't have the greatest defensive awareness. He's got good discipline, though, and I like that. All right, let's compare him to uh, Jared Bull here. It's Jared Bull got Oh, yeah, we can trade away Jared Bull. Yeah, yeah. All right, so Jared Bull. Put him on the table because if we're getting Ott back. And now we're going to have to add some young prospects to the deal here. So goaltenders, no, we got to hold on to these guys. I want to hold on to them to block off, boys. I want to hold on to Torstensen. Let's see how good Torstensen's becoming. Um, you know what I'm thinking? Maybe trade away Dubnik because, yeah, I want him to be our backup, but he's actually he's 28 years old. We haven't locked him up long term. He's 84. He's going to want two and a half, three million at least going into next year. So I think I could trade away Dubnik here. And then Nabokov is our backup. Give Torstensen the first line. And then future, I can I can just sign it back up in the future. Yeah, so we'll put Dubnik on the table. Uh, that won't get it done. We're going to have to add someone else. Defenseman. Got to hold on to Murray, Markov, Oduya. Pewfall. Let's see this guy. He's got good trade value. I think this is the guy I picked up in uh, the free agency. Defensive defenseman. He's got pretty good... Offensive category potential. I want to hold on to him. O'Brien. Here's someone. I wanted to hold on to Quint. Yeah. Okay. So Pufel and O'Brien are two defensive defensemen. But O'Brien is one year older. I already have Quint and Murray still in the minors. I can. I can. Yeah. I can get rid of O'Brien here. Definitely. All right. So we got Bull, Dubnik, and O'Brien for Steve Ott. I think this would go through. Uh, do I have any draft picks I could add to the deal? No, I don't. So let's see if this will go through, all right? The Bull and Ott are basically replacing each other, and then I'm giving them Dubnik and O'Brien. 
O'Brien's a good little prospect, but we already have plenty of defensive prospects in Murray and Quint. We'll be fine. Let's see if it goes through. Uh, okay, one-way contracts. Okay, fair enough. So I think the trade will go through. Let's just make sure that we can send some one-way contracts. There's our timer. Perfect. Uh, Steve Otts, where art thou? Uh, there you are. All right, for Dubnik. Um, what was the other guy? Come on, sort. What the hell? Uh, uh O'Brien and Bull. So who's the one-way contracts here? It's Bull and Dubnik. So it's just one more. Okay. Let's see if they have any crappy goalies they could send back to me one, on one-way contracts. La Barbara. Yeah, he's got one way. He's got a crappy contract. Perfect. All right, so Steve Ott and Jason LaBarbera for Dubnik, O'Brien, and Jared Bull. Will it go through? Uh, okay, so they got to add to the deal a little bit. All right, fair enough. That's fine. That's fine. I really want to get Steve Ott for our team here. He's a good grinder. Um, boo -boo -boo. And he can actually help out our penalty kill as well. Uh, Steve Ott. There you go. You know what? Instead of a LaBarbera, because he actually had a little bit of trade value. Sort the damn players, man. I think my controller's going all wacko here. Uh, one way, one year. Uh, he's got the same amount. One way, two year. You know what? Let me just check out him compared to LaBarbera, who's got more. Ah, they're the same, so I'll just add LaBarbera back. Uh, Dubnik. Where is he? Sort the... What the... My controller's going all funky. What the hell's going on? There you go. Uh, no, not, not Pewfall. O'Brien. Right wingers. Bull. Now, is there anyone else? I'm going to have to add someone else to the deal here. Is there any other young prospects I can add that I know I'm not going to use? Oh, my God. Yeah, my controller's messing up. Got to buy a new controller here. Carol. Let's see this guy. He's 20 years old. Power forward. BBB. Ooh. Got to hold on to him. Got to hold on to him. He's like the same kind of thing. Well, maybe we can trade him. Hang on. Let me see all these guys. Kabanoff. Eisenberg. Let's check out this Eisenberg guy. Uh, left wing playmaker. You know what? I could trade I could trade away this guy. You know why? Because we already have well, let's check out this Johansson guy. He's a two way. B minus yeah, I'd rather hold on to Johansson because we already have plenty of playmakers. I mean Yakupov, Duchesne. I mean we have our uh Kabanov, Oli, who's a sniper. Uh, Shaw, who's a power forward. Grigorenko, who's a sniper. Yeah, I think we can get rid of this Eisenberg guy. We don't need any more, uh, uh, we don't need any more, uh, playmakers. So we'll add Eisenberg to the deal, and that should make it go through right there. He's a two-way. Yeah, all right, so we're giving up a little bit here, but Steve Ott, look at his stats here, boys. I mean, he's good offensively, he's not bad, but look at his defensive category. I know he doesn't have the greatest discipline, but defensive awareness, 85. He's a great body checker, he's got great athletics Good poise. All right, he definitely could help out our uh, our penalty kill. So, yeah, I'm going to make this trade. Dubnik, O'Brien, Bowl, and Eisenberg. Really the only two players that I'm giving away here who can help our team is O'Brien and Eisenberg. But whatever. We'll accept it. All right, let's see if it goes through. Yes, it is. Yes, it does. Uh, the Dallas Stars fans will be cheering in the streets when we announce this deal. I'll take, this deals like, I'll take deals like this any day of the week. Yeah, so will I. So we made our one trade. That's the only trade I'm willing to make, boys. All right. I mean, yeah, that's yeah, that's the only trade I'm willing to make. Uh, not all of your lines. Let me just do the best lines. I don't want to do best lines. Let me just add Ott to the D, uh, the fourth line here. Steve Ott, there you go. All right. As he actually, I think he's left winger, isn't he? Yeah, he is a left winger. So we'll switch him with Moss. Very nice. And we're going to add him to the penalty kill instead of, you know what, instead of Nash. Yeah, uh, Steve Ott, alright, we're going to put him up there, nice little grinder, and then Marshawn can be on the second, we'll see what happens with that, alright, we'll see what happens, and there you go, alright boys, so we're going to end this video, in the next video we'll finish the trade deadline, and we'll go to the uh, end of the season, and we'll see if we can win the President's Trophy, let me know boys, what do you think about Steve Ott?